everyone, welcome to another Maker Monday. Now today's Maker Monday is a little bit special. We're celebrating Threatened Species Week here at the library. So I thought we could make a really cool owl, just like Rover the Barking Owl from the Magic Forest of Gnu. So for our craft today, you'll need some cardboard, some sticks from your backyard, feathers, and some eyes. Are you ready to get started? Okay, so our first step for our Maker Monday today in making our owl is to draw our owl on a piece of cardboard. So I've just used a piece of cardboard from a snack box and I've got my pencil ready to draw the top of our owl. And then we'll give our owl a bit of a round body, just like that. There we go. Okay, so we'll use our scissors to cut around. Now if you do need help from an adult, please ask. Don't forget to save the pieces of cardboard that you'll actually be cutting off because we can use that for a beak on our owl. There we go. So there's our owl shape. Alrighty, so the next step in making our owl is to start gluing on some twigs and sticks. So let's get started. I'm just going to use some PVA glue because it sticks really well. So with the sticks, if they're nice thin ones like this, you can simply break them to the size that you need. Okay, so for our next part in making our owl, we're going to stick on some eyes. Now, as you can see, I've just used a couple of bits of cork that I had lying around. There we go. But you could use some bottle tops if you've got them, or even uh, cupcake liners, patty pan liners. And we're also going to give our owl some feathers for his wings. So we're just going to put some stobs of glue to his little feathers there. Now if you don't have, <coughs> excuse me, if you don't have feathers or anything to use for wings for your owl, have a look around your backyard, see if you've got some leaves that you could use instead. There's lots of leaves falling off the trees in Dubbo at the moment. So our owl's got some wings, he's got some eyes, but what about his beak? Let's give him a beak. So this is where you'll need to use some of the cardboard from your owl shape. There we go. Alrighty. Now let's stick his beak on. There we are. So our owl now has a beak. There we go. All done. 